Alrighty guys, welcome back to Lithia Springs. As you know, we charged up the Gladys yesterday. We really have a chance to use it. This water is extremely clear. And I think I finally fixed the camera on the Gladius, or I understand it better, I should say. So we've come back here to redo this video in a much higher quality format. So we're gonna go ahead and actually put the Gladius in the water. And there's a rock cove over here in the middle. And uh, once we get set up, we'll drop the submersible in the water. We'll have some fun. So let me get across here. I'll see you guys in a minute. So I'm getting ready to put the Gladius in the water here. Everything is getting booted up. I'm gonna go ahead and start the flight controller here on the side. Let's see if we can get this going how it should. I think that powered up. Is we good to go? Yep, however, this is a little too tight, I think. Let's try that on for size. There we go. All right, we got her that time. A little too tight. There's those crazy 4,000 lumen LED lights. We're gonna chuck this thing in here and uh, we're gonna have some fun. So let's see where this takes us, guys.
Jeff on tape. Yeah. Shout outs to Craig for the red eyeballs. They were awesome. They are waterproof. They look super cool. Probably keep the fish at bay. Who knows? Might even fight off a shark. <sighs> to be decided. Well, that was our adventure out here at uh, Lithia Springs again. I hope the footage this time around is better for you guys. We're going to go get something to eat and we'll catch you on the flip, man. Tater real. <laughs> <laughs>